Right, I just wanted to uh, make a quick video um, showing um, a Bluetooth dongle that you can plug into the uh, Tarot ZYX. I was uh, stumbling around the web as you do and come across a site called um, fbl.net.nz and uh, there they include instructions on how to um, make yourself a Bluetooth dongle for your ZYX gyro. So um, I found I found a company in the UK who uh, supplied these Bluetooth um, dongles. And um, I received mine yesterday. So uh, you know, basically though, why I did it was this. I mean, it's a very short little cable in it, really, to be quite honest. And uh, to attach it from your PC, it always means that you're within, you know, short distance of it and you can't move things around things get tugged and pulled all over the place it's just a hassle so I thought I'd go for this Bluetooth dongle I followed the instructions um, and uh, basically that's it neat and uh, actually you can even leave it attached to the gyro and um, you know and uh, adhere the uh, Bluetooth thing to the um, the helicopter itself if you want to so you can leave it permanently attached great if you've got a fuselage as well so uh, you know you do things on the fly just thought I'd show um, quickly how to go about um, setting it up anyway so here it goes right first of all uh, power up early ready to receive a signal. Now all you do, take your standard Bluetooth um, dongle for your laptop, plug it in and let the drivers install. I'm using Windows 7 by the way. Okay, so now that's installing. Can you see that? Takes a couple of seconds. Uh, it says driver device not successfully installed. In, well, on this, I know you can ignore it. I've already pre-installed it, but I've only installed a lot of the stuff just to show you know how to how to do it again for people who don't know. Um, okay, ignore that. Right, the next um, bring up, or oh, you can plug the um, dongle, the Bluetooth dongle, into the gyro. Let's just adjust the camera a minute. Yeah. Well, now that is now flashing and it's waiting to receive a signal. It will go solid red when it gets a, a solid Bluetooth signal from the laptop. So, uh, you know, without flashing away like that, just leave that like that so you can see. Right now we fire up uh, the turret software. And um, go into the Bluetooth icon down the bottom here and it should come up as Linvor that is the device um, named that is, the, that is the Bluetooth device for the uh, gyro okay and if you go into hardware on the properties it says COM9 so uh, we'll OK that minimize that select COM9 from the drop down box 
and uh, connect. The Bluetooth now got a solid connection. It's gone solid red. Okay, and uh, let me just show you, um, you know, what this thing can do. I think I'll just mess with the servo trim just to show you that it's got a virtual Bluetooth thing and it's all working. Side of the slider thing there. Yeah. <coughs> and as you can see, it works a treat. So I don't have to be anywhere near it to do all the uh, little adjustments, which is bleeding brilliant. Anyway, that's it for that one.